We'll be sharing the top 7 tips for when your baby is crying crying is a baby's primary way of communicating their needs. But it can be overwhelming for new parents that's why we've added two extra tips to help you understand why your baby is crying and what you can do to comfort them. Tip number one determine the cause of the crying babies cry for many different reasons including hunger a dirty diaper being too hot or cold being tired or, or just a need for attention it's important to determine the cause of the crying so that you can properly address it crying can also vary in intensity from a subtle whimper to a full-blown wail if your baby is crying loudly and continuously check their diaper first and then offer them a feed Tip number two, skin-to-skin -skin contact. Skin-to-skin -skin contact can help calm a crying baby and regulate their breathing and heart rate. This type of contact is especially effective for newborns and you can try it by holding your baby against your chest and using a blanket to cover them. Tip number three, swaddle your baby. Swaddling is a technique that has been used for centuries to soothe and comfort. Crying babies the idea behind it is to recreate the feeling of being in the womb where babies were tightly surrounded by the walls to swaddle a baby simply wrap them snugly in a blanket with their arms and legs tucked in so that they feel secure and calm. However it's important to be careful not to wrap the baby too tightly as this can restrict their movement and cause discomfort. Tip number four, rock your baby. Try to calm your baby with movement. Babies love to be held and swayed gently. Back and forth, this type of movement mimics the sensation they felt in the womb and can help soothe them when they are upset. You can also try walking with your baby in a carrier or in a stroller. If you have one, try a rocking chair or simply hold your baby and sway gently from side to side. Tip number five, white noise, white noise, such as the sound of a vacuum cleaner, the sound of a hairdryer or a recording of white noise specifically designed for babies can also be helpful in calming a crying baby. The constant soothing sound can help to drown out the other noises that may be bothering your baby such as the sound of a dog barking or the sound of cars passing by. Tip number six, offer a pacifier if your baby is crying and you've tried the other tips and nothing seems to be working. Offering a pacifier can also be helpful. Babies have a natural sucking reflex and using a pacifier can provide a calming sensation for your baby and help them to relax. Tip number seven, take a break as a parent. It can be difficult to hear your baby crying and not be able to soothe. Them taking a break and finding someone to help you for a few minutes can be beneficial for both you and your baby. If no one is around, it's okay to step away for a few minutes and take a deep breath. It can help to reduce stress and prevent you from becoming overwhelmed by understanding the different sounds of a baby's cries and the needs they indicate. You'll be better equipped to soothe your crying baby. Remember your baby is not crying to be difficult they are communicating their needs and feelings with these tips you'll be able to better understand and respond to your babies cries remember every baby is different so it may take some trial and error to find what works best for you and your little one don't be discouraged if it takes time to figure out what suits your baby and most importantly trust your instincts as a parent. If you have any further questions or concerns don't hesitate to reach out to your pediatrician. We hope you found this video helpful. Please like comment and subscribe to our channel for more parenting tips and advice. We would love to hear your experiences and thoughts on this topic. Thank you for watching.